Alright, hey everybody, Biscuits here. Uh, sorry about the awkward lighting, this was the best I can do in this situation. Um, I don't really have a script for this, so I'm just gonna kinda say whatever comes out and hopefully it makes for a decent trailer. I ask that you hear my story and then we'll go from there. Back in November, I adopted a very adorable little orange kitten and I knew from the moment I saw him that he was gonna be my Oliver because I'm a Disney freak. I love Oliver and company and I've always wanted an Oliver. So, um, he came home with us late November, and so, you know, we had our Christmas and our New Year's and, you know, February, Valentine's Day, I guess, and, uh, then came March, where, um, he started acting weird, and basically, in the blink of an eye, before I could even realize what was going on, I was taking Oliver to the emergency room. Um, this was my very first emergency vet visit. I've never had to deal with really vets at all, much less an emergency room. So it was very nerve wracking um, to find out that something was wrong with Oliver. Um, basically in the course of a week, eight days, um, we went through many tests and many visits and more emergency room visits and stress and lack of food and sleep and basically everything being wrong with the world um until saint patrick's day we basically ruled out every other possibility except this rare but very fatal disease called fip which stands for feline infectious pervert i don't know how to pronounce the last word here it is you know and uh info will be in the description and everything um but, so, FIP. Think of it like kitten cancer. There's no real diagnosis, which means there's no cure, either. So once you get this diagnosis that FIP is what this is, you have to make that decision to let them go and let, you know, stop their suffering. And so on St. Patrick's Day, that's what we had to do. And so, um... That explains why we haven't been posting videos for a little bit. We are on a temporary hiatus, but we will be back very soon. Um, but in the meantime, and this is why I'm here, I have been organizing a charity live stream. And um, so we will be streaming on Twitch uh, May 4th from 12 p.m. to midnight, straight 12-hour stream. Um, that's Eastern time. And um, we're going to be raising money to donate to the Bria Fund, um, which is a fund to support the research of FIP. And everything you need is going to be in the description below, links and whatnot. And so, um, yeah, it is absolutely heartbreaking being a cat mom who had to lose their fur baby. And that's what it comes down to, you know, for me... And for a lot of pet owners, they're not just pets. There are kids, there are family. So I want to do my part in helping figure out how the fuck to stop this. Because this shouldn't happen to any cat owner. And honestly, this shouldn't happen to any kitten before, you know, they even know what life is. We lost Oliver at eight months old. He didn't even make it to a year old. So, um, I invite you all to join us. Everybody on the Pineapple Gaming team will be there on May 4th, 2018, from 12 noon to 12 midnight. And right now, our, our website, pineapplegamingshow.com, uh, links to the actual Facebook event for this live stream. So you can go ahead and join that yourself or share it on your own profiles with your friends, spread the word, get this as far across the internet as you possibly can because I can't do this alone. We at Pineapple Gaming can't do this by ourselves. We need help. And honestly, I want to raise as much awareness as possible for this stream. Not for us, not for our channel, not for popularity, but to fight FIP. So, you know, hashtag fight FIP, um, hashtag for the kittens. Uh, and hey, why not? Hashtag may the fourth be with you. Um, cause we, we could use, we could use the force on our side for this one. And I thank everybody who's supported us along the way so far. And 
I'm sorry to ask that you just support us a little more during this time of hardship. Um, thank you for understanding um, our absence. Like I said, we'll be back very soon.